Uh, here we go again. Got an Antec 1200 here. We're going to be calling this build Experts Glowfall. And uh, this is uh, the reservoir. I just built it. I made it as tight as possible to fit in there. Fits nice and tight right on it. And uh, I frosted. Uh, it's hard for the camera to see it. <laughs> there you go. I don't know if you can see in there. But basically, I frosted the interior this time and the exterior so the whole reservoir will glow from any kind of light source. Let me poke out the grill here up top. Fit so tight, you gotta kind of mount it like this. But uh, here it is. This is a couple of the innovations. I don't know if you can see it, the camera picking it up here. We got slots in it, so it slides on the tabs. Two ports in the back, fill port. For instance, this is a Cooler Master. And this is what's frustrating about trying to make something universal. I can make it so it fits the Cooler Master very nice indeed. Uh, see how that flushes out. Let's see where the screw holes are for the optical drive. See where the holes line up for the pins? Absolutely perfect, right? Looks very nice. And on the 1200, you can't put it in the top bay without trimming the lip here just about a sixteenth. So if he wants it up top, that's fine. We can do that. But this works good too. And this gives you it makes it a little maybe a little easier to fill too. Let's pop that in there. If that was him, I'd have a light here, DVD here, hard drive, hard drive. But uh, that's really up to him. I'll talk to him, see how he likes it. And uh, that's the latest waterfall reservoir I got. Lots more of them to put together. I got four more to go. And uh, having too much fun doing it, let me tell you, there's so much work. You got to slot, drill, tap. You got the tops, a special little doodad. You got to glue a little doodad into it, drill and tap that. And there's a lot of little things. Anyway, more of the madness later.